creeping mist engulfs the Devon coast. The lighthouse shines its warning to the blind ships at sea. On the cliffs, the distant call of the shepherd's whistle echoes through the fog, whilst a lone ewe bleats forlornly, her flock hidden among the hills and cleaves. As night draws in, it is only the owl who cuts through the milky darkness, gliding silently to perch on the old barn door. And it is here she witnesses the beginning of three new lives. It's okay now, little ones. It's all right. You're safe here with me. Shh. Who's there? Fear not, fear not. It's only Sir Gregory. Oh, Dad, it's you. You're working late. Yes, so much for my retirement day. Oh, the, the boss needed me to bring the flock away from the cliffs. They can't see the end for the best of time. Dad. Oh, you've had them. I'm a grandfather again, and about time too. Let's see how many we have there. Uh, one and two. And who? Oh, three. And good-looking pups they are too. Uh, do they have names yet? Well, the big boisterous one with the white stripe on his head is called Storm. Storm? Good strong name. <laughs> and a hungry fella too. And the one with a snowy white ear is called Drift. Ah, yes. Barely any black on her at all. Not ideal for a working dog though. The sheep think you're one of them. <laughs> Aha! Now that little one has more than her fair share of black. She's got the look of a proper sheepdog. What's she called? Or I haven't decided yet. I thought maybe her grandfather could pick a name. Me? Well, what an honor. <laughs> Let me see. A good sheepdog name. Mist. Mist. Yes, I like that. Mist. What do you think, Gail? 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 Oh. Sleep well, Gail. You've earned it. And as Gail slept soundly, Sir Gregory sat steadfast upon the bales, keeping a proud watch over the three newcomers to Barra Farm. Storm, drift, and mist.